Hello guys, this is Yo from Anywhere again, and today we are gonna introduce you another another new product from us, and I'm sure you must be very curious about it. And this is this one. This one is about our latest latest launches product, the PTZ, uh, the PTZ cameras, which can support it like the uh, times room, like three, ten, twelve, twenty, thirty times, and it's all your choice. And let's open this box and see what is in this. Yes, and now we are already uh, put all, get all the accessory out from our the, our our box, and you can see here is the, all the accessory for, come from come with our PTZ camera. And first, we of course we will we will have a menu about it to to tell us how to setting how to setting our PTZ camera. And of course, the PTZ camera itself, and you can see here is the all the overlook, and I will show you in detail uh, later later in this video. And of course, it has a remote. Remote can be able to help us to. To uh, rotate it, to rotate it, the camera, and also can setting about the preset, about nine preset, a uh, nine preset, and uh, we can control it by the button. And also we have the uh, button to, to to switch the camera, which one is our running. And this also, of course, here I have a menu in this, have menu at this remote to setting about all the specific specification about this PTZ camera. And here are some cable here, and this one is for the SDI port, and you can use this this cable to connect the SDI port with the uh, display device and showing the image. And of course, power adapter, and uh, you must be really familiar with it. It can be it it working for communicate, uh, connected with the PC camera and uh, to provide power to the camera itself. And we can see have some different port about this camera, and it seem like a really com complicated because uh, there's many too many ports and there's no worry I cannot I will be introduce you uh, clearly for what kind of the port using in the what environment you can see as below we have two port with the uh, RS we call the RS232 and RS485 port it's mainly for to uh, for this for these cameras connect with each other and uh, connect to the uh, switching uh, joyce, joystick keyboard then we can control all of this camera in the one single uh, joystick keyboard. We also can see there is a two point that they this call this one called 3 gsd iPod and this one called HDMI port and uh, it must is mainly for the uh, video data output port. Uh, all the video data will be transferred from this two port to the uh, display device. I'm doing a charge live streaming that we will have the uh, really long distance from the from the camera to the like the control machine, like the uh, monitor, so we have the, this two point, and the, this 3 gsd iPod will be su able to su support about uh, like hundreds of meters to to transfer data without any damage from the data and without any transfer delay. And we also have have the LAN port here. LAN port is for the connected the internet because if we are doing a live streaming, we must to. Uh, live streaming our video source to up to internet, up to our server, and uh, to to both to broadcast them. So we have to have the LAN port to make sure that we can connect it to the uh, the internet environment, like the local internet or the public internet. Yeah, and here's all the port. Uh, the port maybe is really many of uh, many for for you guys, but uh, all these ports have their really really clear purpose for for why they are here. So let's review it, and uh, you can see this port. This port. This part of port will be connected with the different camera, and this part of port will be able to transfer output the video data, and this port will be supporting the camera to connect to the internet. Yes, and now we already get our PTZ camera to connect it to the power, and it will be uh, it will be a power on. And now we are using the remote to control it to rotate it, and to show you how it how it will rotate it and how it work, how the PTZ work. As you can see. We are just like that and right, and the, the speed will be controlled if you long touching the button and it will be going faster, and if you do not, then you just click it and it will be can be adjust adjust the angle slightly. Yeah, you can also can up and down. That also can be done. Yeah, down to the shooting the shooting the the table to the surface, and if you are. Uh, reverse it to it reverse it, install the reverse and also you can it, it, the, this angle can help you show in the model review and then turn left and turn right and up and down yes you can see here's our, how we show in our PTT camera how to rotate it by the remote
here it's showing the zooming effect of our 30x PTZ camera, able to see item crystal clear 40 to 50 meters away. And that is the main thing you you usage for this kind of camera because uh, for our some live live event, some big event, we would like to show in some uh, a big a big live streaming, and it have to be cooperate with uh, cooperate with the many of the or many of camera at the same time. And you can see here is the outlooking, and this one can have the three t three t times zoom in and zoom out to to make sure that we can be showing the live streaming, like showing the event showing the evidence really clearly. Thank you for watching our video and if you want to know more information about our products, welcome to visit below, below the website and we will uh, post our update, update latest and uh, show you the latest market information. And if you like our video, please click the follow, click the follow and uh, click the subscribe about our channel. Uh, uh, we will daily to update our new video showing all of our products. <music>